So this is my breakfast that I usually have when I don't have eggs. I had Go Lean Crunch and Life Cereal. Hi everybody, today is, I forgot what day it was. Oh, it's Saturday and it's Memorial Day weekend and this is gonna be a challenge this week, I can tell you that already. But I wanna tell you something really, something interesting that I made today that took like three seconds and it was so delicious. I made these, so good. They're like little ice cream cakes and they're made of graham crackers, uh, Cool Whip, which is sugar-free and vanilla pudding. And oh my gosh, they're so good. It's like, it's like ice cream, you can't even believe it. So I'll have to show you the rest of today. I'll show you later on. We had fish and we had rice. It was a really good day. For lunch this day, I had sushi and it was really good. Maybe a little bit of sodium, but it was delicious in general. Then our dinner was really good. It was a piece of cod with some tomato basil sauce. Really good. Yum. The Jimmy Dean's breakfast sandwich with turkey sausage and my Dan and Fit Light yogurt. So I found this delicious salad. It had a bunch of field greens in it, pecans, walnuts, and a little bit of chicken and blue cheese. So delicious. Then I had sushi again. I was in the mood for sushi all weekend. I don't know, maybe I was having a sodium deficiency, but it was really good. And then I had the PB2 powder and the banana and cocoa powder that was like free calories, 450 calories. And that was on to Memorial Day. So this was Memorial Day. Again, I had my usual breakfast, the turkey sausage on the biscuit, and I had the Dan and Fit light yogurt for 80 calories, really good. And then we just had like a lunch dinner kind of combo with a hamb one hamburger. I had some guacamole and bro broccoli slaw, and I didn't count the calories. I didn't, I wasn't gonna do that. And then we had a, a slice each of this dessert, which was 480 calories, like a silk pie. And today is Tuesday already. And for Tuesday, I did an avocado with eggs on a Ezekiel muffin, just one muffin, and a little bit of Swiss cheese. I had a couple of handful of cherries. And then again, I had that wonderful salad from Walmart with the blue cheese and walnuts and chicken. And then here was a little bit of hummus I had for a snack. It was all really good and feeling good today. So yeah, it was all good. So the last thing I had was a sandwich with uh, turkey and Swiss cheese and some carrots and arugula. So t on Wednesday for breakfast, I had what I had the day before, which was scrambled eggs and avocado on an English muffin. I had the Thai Buddha bowl. And then I had the mixed green salad with quinoa. Super good, I love the salad. Then for my snack, at the end of the day, I had a Yasso bar, a Yasso Greek yogurt bar, and it was really, really good. Then on Thursday, I had my cereal, and I had two chicken sausages, chicken apple sausages on brown berry bread and some Swiss cheese and ketchup. Then for dinner, I had a romaine salad with some pepperoncinis and some olives. Then I made this uh, chicken meatballs with a little bit of pasta, about a quarter cup and some sauce. And then I had my dessert, which I love, which I showed you earlier. <laughs> and then today I had my cereal that I normally have. And then I made an iced coffee and I had soy milk and some instant coffee as the base of the coffee and it was 60 calories, really good. Then I had my salad again, same salad as yesterday. And then I had the Weight Watchers beef stroganoff with egg noodles. Then finally I had the graham cracker and whipped um, Cool Whip and so good. And so this is the recap. I hope you enjoy this week. Thanks so much for coming and have a great week, everybody. Hi, 
everyone and welcome back to my channel healthy happy hooray this is Regina and as you all know I am on a weight loss journey to lose 200 pounds this week was good we had a holiday here in the United States we had Memorial Day and that's the day when everybody eats like hot dogs and chips and drinks alcohol and has a good time and um, I I had fun. I actually had my hamburger, my coleslaw, or my broccoli slaw, and some of the things that we usually eat on that day. I also did have a piece of French silk pie, which was delicious. And I had my Doritos, which I like. I'm not in love with them, but I like them. And so it was a good week. Um, just to let you know, my weight loss this week was, I, I weighed in at 324.4 this morning. So that means I lost 0.4 which is great for me because I feel like not every week is, week is going to be a loss. And also I know that realistically this takes time. And also it was, you know, I had thrown in some extra calories on Memorial day. So anyway, it doesn't matter. I am happy with the, how the week went. I also want to explain to you, if you don't know why I do this, um, I do a week of my food and then I do a recap at the end of the week. I do this because when I was searching for answers, from other people who had lost weight. I wanted to see exactly what they ate. A lot of times they're kind of vague about it or they would do like what I eat in a day. And while that's helpful, I feel like I wanna know like exactly what you're eating. Maybe that's a little anal, reten anal retentive of me, but it helps me a lot to kind of understand. And I liked if people were transparent and said, you know what, today was a bad day. I ate McDonald's or I, I didn't track or whatever, because I feel that's, that's important too. You know, not every, not every day is going to be perfect and the whole point of all this is to just keep going and not give up and just you know just keep on keeping on and so that's why I do these week these weekly videos of what I ate so I can show you exactly what I ate and I'm trying to be as transparent as I can and this week I was I showed you the cake I showed you the Doritos I showed you what I ate on that day and I promise to do that going forward because it's, it's not going to help me if I don't tell the truth. If I say, oh, well, I ate this and then I, you know, ate a bunch of stuff after. That's not going to help anything. It's not going to help me, me to get to where I need to get to. So thank you for watching my videos. If you haven't subscribed already, already and you want to be part of this, I would really appreciate it. If you subscri subscribe, you can see the videos that come out. You can see my weigh-ins every Friday and Saturday. It's either Friday night or Saturday when I post the video. And it would just really, just really help me if you could comment and tell me what you're doing. Cause I know a lot of us out there are on this journey and um, yeah, I just want to help each other. So thanks for listening. Thanks for understanding. And I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your week and keep on being healthy. All the best.